Sometimes you'll never know the value of a moment until it becomes a memory. We are Nina and Joe Ruhlman. And this is our son, Jet. And we are the founders of our nonprofit, Kentucky Derby. Our mission is to help children's hospitals and organizations raise money to help fund the programs to get kids the ever-evolving care that they need. We started the Kentucky Derby um, in honor of, of our son Jet here. Um, we had a two and a half week long stint at the NICU at Children's Mercy Hospital and we, it weighed on our hearts very heavily that we needed to find a reason and find a purpose to give back to the hospital that helped save our, our child's life. And to create this, this ornery and rambunctious little toddler that he is today. My name is Erica Molitor Kirsch and I'm the medical director of the pediatric ICU at Children's Mercy Hospital. My name is Hannah Cunningham. I am the director of nursing here in the pediatric ICU at Children's Mercy Hospital. At Children's Mercy in the ICU, we admit more than 2,500 children a year. In addition to the immediate Kansas City area and the surrounding Kansas City area, since we're the only children's hospital in this area, we also have a huge encatchment area. So we take kids from all of Kansas, uh, western Missouri, southern Iowa, uh, eastern Colorado, and northern Oklahoma. So that's where, why we have such a large number of children. Year after year, we have seen really increasing amounts of growth in the ICU. So about 8% per year, so many more kids per year, and that's really been sustained. Well, recently we've been excited to uh, embark on expansion of our ICU and it looks like so far we're going to probably be able to expand to another 26 beds so that'll mm -hmm. be nice mm -hmm. we'll be up to 40 or 67 beds mm -hmm. um, and we're hoping that will really help us take care of more and more mm -hmm. children. You're there day in and day out with your child there's only so many halls and, and so many areas to go to kind of be alone or get peace with what's going on You know that the ER exists. You know that the NICU exists. You know that the PICU exists. But you don't truly understand the value of those units until you, you need it. And I always thought, you know, we would never be the family that needs it. We're, we're healthy. We, we, you know, our, our kids are healthy. And you just don't ever think that you're gonna wake up one day and you're gonna be in that position there's been a, a really large expansion in terms of our staff. So, you know, there's, there's 22 ICU physicians that work in the ICU now. We've got about 250 nurses that work in our department. You know, people will ask us, you know, what, do, what does the community need from us? And, and really, I think you're a perfect example of that, is sharing your story. And, and so many people out in the community, I don't think, recognize how many critically ill patients and, and children that we take care of on a day-to-day -day basis. And so really sharing that story is, I think, something that is, is truly special because you probably have connected with, with other families that may have um, kind of shared similar experiences or had really um, ill children. And that is such a devastating and, and stressful time in your life. And so to, to recognize, you know, what services that we have here. And while, you know, our, our hope is that we never want um, anybody to have to walk through our, our doors, but if they do, we want to be able to provide that really high quality level of service and to take the best possible care of your child as our ultimate goal. Thank God for a hospital that, that cares for our children just as much as we do, because they, they fought to save his life. Because of your donation, Children's Mercy is able to grow and provide medical help to every child 
as they strive to bring children one step closer to going home healthy.